Hello, Dave. Yeah, I'm alright, not too bad. How are things? <laughs> yeah, no, good stuff, man. Good stuff. Um, so, what's up? Wait, wait, what do you mean I'm not meant to be playing Ronald Hernandez? Right, no, I get that. I get it's all some sort of weird scheme to just put him to Atlanta at the end of the season, but I, I thought I could at least play him while he's here. Alright, cool. Alright, cool. We'll just pretend he's got an injury or something. Yeah, and no, I'll get Shea back into the team. Right, catch you later. Bye bye. <laughs> Hello, and welcome back to the channel. Today, it is our biggest game so far. It is Wolfsburg in the Europa League third round qualifying. Let's just jump into the game then. So this is the team we're going with for the game against Wolfsburg. We are going significantly more defensive than normal. We've got Johnny Hayes at left back, Logan on the right, Constein and Taylor in the middle. Ojo, Ferguson and McRory make up the midfield with Kennedy and Hedges out on the wings and Marley Watkins up front. Our bench, we've got Thomas Cherney, Cole De Silva, Greg Lee, Dylan McGeek, Dean Campbell, Niall McGinn, and Curtis Main. As you heard in the intro, Ronald Hernandez is injured um, for at least three weeks there. Um, he's got pulled knee ligaments. So this is the first look at Wolfsburg lineup. Um, don't really recognize many of the names there, but I'm sure they're good. So uh, let's get our team talk done. We're going to pump the fists and it is a great opportunity to show the pundits that they've been right to back us up so far. The team are motivated, we're pumped, we're ready to go, except Marley Watkins and Johnny Hayes, but let's go. Right, here we go boys. Our biggest game so far. Europa League third round qualifier match against Wolfsburg. Okay, and Matty Kennedy is injured 11 minutes into the game. That is just superb. So now McGinn's going to come on. And I swap them around. Yeah, I'm going to put Hedges out on the left and McGinn on the right as an inside forward. Right, there we go. Not the best start, but let's get into it. Here we go, first highlight of the game, corner to Wolfsburg. We clear it. Love to see it. Ball back. They're coming at us now down the left. We need to be careful here. He goes past one. No one's on the end of it. But they're going to get the ball back in. Great block. Great defending there. Clearance not so much. They're coming back at us. They're going to tackle in. There we go. And it's cleared. You love to see it. Right, free kick. Now I'm again over the top. Taylor's through. And it's saved. There's our first real chance of the game. It's nice to see we've got a chance. Can we go into half time on a level playing field? We can indeed, right? So we've got to half time and it is nil nil. Just a reminder with these Europa League games, it is just a one legged tie. So there is the potential for extra time and penalties if needed. Right, team talk, outstretched arms. Delighted with the performance, keep it going. Now, they're all inspired and motivated, apart from Matty Kennedy, but we'll just... Right, second half's underway. Let's go. Right, we've got just over half an hour left, or just under half an hour left. 20 minutes now. We're not really getting much highlights. So let's make a sub and see if we can maybe grab a last sort of late goal. Um, Shea Logan, we'll take him off. Lewis Ferguson looks absolutely shattered, which is annoying because he's one of our best players. Can McGrory play that position? No, I'll just leave him. Um, and we'll leave that as that then. That's our three subs. Right, let's go. Back into it. Let's go, boys. Just under 15. We're still in this. It's 0-0. 10 minutes to go. 
They've got a throw in. Could be dangerous. Just going to try and get the ball in. They get the cross in. Header. Just over. We're inside the final 10. Right, we're at the stoppage time. Are we going to force extra time here? We are indeed. Right, so we're going to extra time with Wolfsburg here. We had three shots, two on target, to their 19 and eight on target. So we've been defending very well, clearly, um, if we've stopped them scoring, right? So pump the fists, get them motivated again. Right, let's go, boys. Come on, 30 minutes. All your hard work could pay off here. Right, we're almost at halfway through extra time. That's fine by me, that's fine by me. Um, let's start second half. We've still not had any more attempts. They've had a few. 10 minutes to go. They're passing out from the back. This could be a chance for them here. Oh, McGinn picks it up. He's coming forward. Plays it to McGeoch. McRory. Ojo. Can he get it out wide? He's coming in the left now. Can he get the ball in? It's McGeoch. Ojo. McRory. We're just playing it about now. Watkins to Silva. McCrory, through to Watkins. Watkins, can he do it? Oh, what a tackle. Corner kick. Right, come on, boys. Hedges is going to take the corner. Ein swinger from the left. Oh, cleared. And now they're out in the counter. This is where we need to be careful and not get hit. The defence, there we go. Hayes with the interception. Superb. Now we're just passing it about. Constein to Ojo. Another... Great bit of defensive work there. Um, right, tactics wise, I think we can make one more. Um, so I'm going to bring on. Eh. Actually, I'm just going to leave it now. I don't want to bring on anyone just now, just in case we mess it up. And there was no one there that I thought could change it. Right, we're inside the final three. Stoppage time. Last chance here. We're going forward. Watkins. Watkins. He's still got the ball. He shoots. Saved. And that'll be it. We're going to penalties. <sighs> right. Right. Let's give them a wee team talk. We're going to pump the fists. No, actually. No, that's not right. Keep fighting to the end. Let's go. That's a huge... One for us to let's change that camera angle. Wolfsburg up front, up first. And they score. Right, Ryan Hedges. Come on. Ryan Hedges, it's saved but it goes in. Let's go. Wolfsburg here. And it's a great penalty. From Bre Brickle. Right, Dylan McGeek. He goes and it's in. What a pen. What a pen. Right, William. I'm sure that's not how you pronounce it. Here we go. He goes for it. Straight down the middle. Lewis dives to his right hand side. Right, now McGinn with our third penalty. Can he bury it? And it's saved. It is saved by the keeper. And Wolfsburg have the advantage. Right, Gerhardt. Gerhardt. He's coming forward. And he's buried it. Right, we need to score this. Or we are out. The European dream is over for another year. I can't bear to look. Who's taking it? Funzo Ojo. Come on, son. He buries it. We've been given a lifeline with that goal. Now, if Wolfsburg score this, we're out. Baku steps up to take it. Can Joe Lewis make himself a hero? And it's in! And in agonising fashion, Wolfsburg knock Aberdeen out of the Europa League. Our European journey comes to an end for another 
year. I can't argue with the boys though, absolutely fantastic performance to take it to penalties in the first place. Look at the defensive performance, Joe Lewis man of the match with an 8.4, you really can't argue with that. Any other day we could have potentially won that. Outstretched arms, I can't fault that. If we play like that this season, we could get by anyone. That was solid defensive work. From facing Bundesliga opposition in the Europa League to Dingwall on a Sunday afternoon. Next up, we're back in the league and it is Ross County away from home. In the league, we currently find ourselves in third place just ahead of Motherwell and significantly behind Rangers and Celtic um, at this point. So a win here will do us absolute wonders in trying to cement ourselves in a European spot this season. So let's jump into it. Right, so this is the team that will be facing Ross County in Dingwall. Joe Lewis stays in goals. Back line of Lee, Logan, Constein and Taylor. Ojo, Ferguson, McGrory in midfield as always. Johnny Hayes pushes up the park to the left wing. Scott Wright on the right wing. And Marley Watkins is still up front with Cosgrove out. Ryan Edmondson is currently back. You'll probably see him come off the bench at some point during the game. Um, but yeah, Cosgrove is still a couple of weeks away from getting back into the team. Right, so there's the two teams. Ross County coming out with the usual lineup, um, and you've already seen our team there. Team talk, pump the fists, get them a bit motivated. Um, we're second the Premiership on form table. It's important to keep a good run. Cool. Right, so here we go. Let's jump into the game. Right, Ross County are coming forward now. When you get the ball off them, way too much space. And Connor Randall with the early goal. 12 minutes in and Ross County have taken the lead. This is not a good start for us here. Right, Randall to Stewart. Back. They're killing us on this right-hand side. See the ball in? Right, Lee gets rid of it. Right, Hayes, I need you to do the work now. That's through again, but Lee clears it. Ball up the park, but Watkins is nowhere to be seen. Considine. Great defending just to get in his space, put him off the header. Out wide to Hayes McGrory. Lee on the left. Loses the ball, but he wins it back. Into Ferguson. Ferguson through to Watkins. Watkins! Puts it wide. Great. Right, we're half an hour in. We need to get back into this game. We've not had a shot on target. As I say that, we get a shot on target. And Stewart with the goal. I think we need to do something at half time here. Potentially sell the team, is that a possibility? Right, we're thrashing arms, far from pleased. Tactics, right. Edmondson's going up top. Well, actually, scrap that. Undo. Ojo's coming off. Edmondson on for Ojo. Then have Hedges on for Johnny. Swap them two around. Cole De Silva on for Shea. Let's try that. Second half. Buttload of changes. Let's try and get back into the game. Right, Constantine to Lee. Lee over to McRory. McRory to Edmondson. De Silva. Out wide, Hedges. Back to De Silva. McRory. We're pinging it about now. I like to see it. Hedges cuts inside. To no one. And now count here on the break. But it's fine. Constantine saves the day. Hedges coming forward. Watkins. Edmondson. Ryan Edmondson. He's been on the pitch for two minutes. Back from injury. And it's his first goal for the Dons. Look at this. Absolutely superb. Hedges. Powers forward to Watkins. Edmondson on the left. First time shot. Straight in the top corner. you love to see it. Corner kick. De Silva's going to take it. He's going to swing it in. Keeper grabs it. Easy as he like. 
counter your through. Stuart through is going to score. Great save. Not too sure about the clearance, but there we go. Free kick to Silva. Swings it in. Hedges. Constant. Marley Watkins with the goal. And we are back in it. Within six minutes of the second half, we are back at level pegging. Watkins with a poacher's finish. You love to see it. Right, Constantine with the throw. Long throw. Ferguson. Oh, offside. Right, who was offside? It was a throw in. Surely not. He was not in the way. If we don't win this now, we have been absolutely shafted there. We've got 20 minutes left. Let's see what we can do. Midfield looking a bit ropey. Let's bring on Campbell and McGeek. Just about a fresh legs in the middle of the park. And we're gonna bring on ah, that's fine. That's our full full five subs for that that'll do. Hopefully that helps us with that bit of, you know, fresh legs in the midfield. Just under ten minutes to go. Ross County with a goal kick. Campbell picks it up. Lee. Back to Campbell, Constein. There's plenty of better midfield. Let's get it forward. Right. Over the top, Watkins. Is that a penalty? It is. Edmonton's going to take the penalty. Can he get his second goal of the game and send us ahead? He can! Ryan Edmondson, the talisman. What we've been missing this season. The second goal of the game. The penalty. Cam as you like. And I'm going to have a bit of praise now. 10 minutes to go and we are 3-2 up. Right, we're heading to stoppage time. Are we going to get any highlights here? And that is all she wrote. What a comeback, that second half. Absolutely incredible. Ryan Edmondson, rightfully so, man of the match. After coming on at half time, he got two goals and sends us away from Dingwall with the three points. Outstretched arms. Good win. Well done, boys. And with that win, that puts us five points clear of Motherwell in third place. We're only two points off of Celtic. They do have a game in hand, um, but again, we are two points away from potentially a Champions League spot there. Um, so things aren't going too badly at all. Unfortunately, we're out of Europe, but means we can just focus on the league now right so next episode we will be back we're going to crack on with the league games we will come back for the trip to ibrox on the 21st of november this will be a double header with the betfred cup game we don't know who we're getting just yet um, but that'll be played just after that so that'll be the double header for the next episode now that we're no longer in Europe we will be cracking on with us and we will be getting through these seasons at quite a quick rate as always guys thank you very much for the support on the channel so far it's been absolutely incredible we just hit 200 subscribers as of recording this so again massive big up to everyone for all the support if you like the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, share it with your pals, leave a comment down below, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.